Holding out okay? All right, well, my wife told me I should talk more, so blame her. I'm going to introduce this next song. It's from the new record, In Violet. And uh, this song is called Greenish Blues. Now, um, well, first I wanted to thank you because uh, it seems that In Violet, at 62, I'm having a record that's being received by both the press and the fans better than anything since Passion of Warfare, so. I could be a contender. That is very nice. And, uh, <laughs> so, uh, yes, this is Greenish Blues, and you know, when you, when you release a record, you talk to the press, because, uh, you know, you gotta let people know, you got a record out, you're going on tour, and they ask about the songs, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, well, not sometimes, but all the times, they ask the same questions for 35 years, but that's okay. I'm a good subject, because I can talk about Frank Zappa all day. <laughs> but, uh, you know, as I was uh, kind of going through my earlier days and picking various symbols and things like that to brand my, my, brand, my brand, you know, create a brand, uh, I always found myself, for some reason, turning to the color green. I call it Alien Love Secrets Green. It's that bright, beautiful green that I use. It also reminds me of nature and all that stuff. Um, so they ask, well, what is, is Greenish Blues about? Because is it a tribute to the great Peter Green? Yeah? You know, Peter Green, fantastic, uh, authentic blues player. I mean, he was the founder of Fleetwood Mac. You know, outstanding player. But I have to tell them no. It's just because I branded myself with the color green. So if you're gonna hear any kind of blues coming out of me, it's gonna be greenish blues. <laughs> and that's the song. Enjoy. Mm -hmm. 